So hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about anti-racism, especially in light of the U.S. campaign. So due to the economical, social and political systems of set up around the world, racism is an intuition that has been present for centuries. The voices of those who try to amplify the notion of anti-racism and fight against racial divisions that continue to fester and develop in societies, especially Western societies, have been silenced and marginalized for long. However, with the recent death of George Floyd, Ahmed Arbery, and Breonna Taylor in America under the hands of white supremacists, the setting is slowly beginning to shift to allow the voices of the oppressed to emerge gradually. Unfortunately, the slight culture shift has also been the reason of discomfort among those who perpetuate racism and are quick to build walls of defenses by retaliating, I'm not racist, while completely failing to understand their role in maintaining racism and taking any sort of accountability. However, what most do not understand is that simply saying you're not racist is not enough to challenge the racism so deep in many political institutions. The opposite of racism is anti-racism, not not racist. Therefore, in order to effectively defeat systemic racism, especially in areas such as education and healthcare, one must first acquire an understanding of their position in a racist society and the privileges they hold as members of that society. Simply acknowledging the fact that you live in a society that disadvantages and oppresses a certain racial group in order to alleviate the social standing of another is not enough. You must actively fight against it and strive to not only undo it psychologically, but also within the environment that you live in. As the world continues to encounter the death of many innocent souls simply for being born into a certain racial group, today more than ever we must learn to be more than not racist and instead strive to be anti-racist.